Hey guys, so what's wrong with you? Guys, so we we'll react to a very amazing story. Like when I saw this, I was like, what? Ah. Guys, they're going to react to Christian pastor in South Africa led his followers to convert to Islam in a church. Guys, I want to say this. Let's just get straight into this. Help us build an Islamic studio at www.islamicstudio.org link in the description. Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. Many Christians in a South African church converted to Islam led by their pastor. Subhanallah. This is just so amazing. Let's watch and hear them taking Shahada. I will speak in Arabic. And then I will translate in English. And you will uh, translate it in Zulu. Everybody repeat after me. Ashadu. Ashadu. Allah. 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 My brothers and sisters, you have watched that many people many christians they have accepted islam inside their church and it was led by their pastor subhanallah in many different part of the world people are coming to islam in mass numbers from asia to europe to africa islam became the fastest growing religion from social media influencers to athletes, scientists, businessmen, entrepreneur, you name it. People are loving Islam and they are coming into the folds of Islam. We have to do a lot of istighfar. We have to thank Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and we have to take responsibility to spread this beautiful message of this deen across the globe. If anyone is guided to Islam through you, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will reward you abundantly. Any good deed he or she does will get the same reward without any reward being deducted from him or her. It's a win-win situation. It's like affiliation of rewards. It's like leaving a legacy. So my brothers and sisters, let's strive hard to take this responsibility of da'wah to call people towards Islam. May Allah give us the ability to spread the beautiful message of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala across the globe and may Allah forgive all of our sins. May Allah give us Jannatul Fardaus al Please support our da'wah works at www. Support Guys, I really don't understand that kind of church. Go. I don't understand why they are all wearing white, but I feel they took this step. Maybe Pastor found truth in Islam and he was like, I'm a pastor, you are following me. I found truth here, so I feel we should all go there and they accept it. But I like the fact that that's what they wanted to do and they went for it. I believe that everyone will go for what they see makes sense. And if you believe without any doubt that this is the right way to go, I feel we go for it. So I felt that is what happened to the pastor. But that's kind of strange. But to be honest, I personally do not believe in white coming church. Like, see, Christianity is big. Like, we, we are many. And we have a lot of denominations. And... I would say why we have a lot of denomination because some people actually go people actually practice stuff that are not meant to be practiced. Like some people actually believe in going to the river to pray. Some people believe in a lot and I believe they also believe in a lot and they feel or 
they saw that what they believe in did not match the description of who God is. And they went for what they went for. But guys, think of it. Personally, I've seen a lot of Christians actually going to Muslim. I have seen Muslims actually converting to Christianity. Like the pastor of who is know this church, Christ Ambers. This that's the church I go to. The pastor there was actually the pastor there now is he was a Muslim and he converted to Christian and he is a pastor, like he's bringing people to God. And I'll say it's vice versa. Like what I have come to think, like I bet you I'm making research, like high quality research. And what I've come to see is that Christianity and Islam, we are both in the glass house. Like if you stole me, I stole you, our glass will get broken. Like it's it's I don't know how I'll put it. But it's because I know there are some people that actually attack Christianity like this, and I've seen Christians actually attacking Muslims. I'm not I don't mean physical attack, but like based on both believing and like the Muslim guy just couldn't talk. Like he was like I've seen it. I've seen Muslim attacking Christian where like it's 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 a two-way sword, like it's a two-edged sword. But guys, tell me what you think about this. Then should like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time, guys. Best.